A Bemidji woman is dead after crashing her car during a police chase following a stabbing. Lakeland News reporter Sherelle Moore has details. Last night, just after 10, the Beltrami County Sheriff's Office was called to the 5600 block of Alps Court to handle a domestic dispute. The night ended with a deadly crash in a ditch along Highway 89. Uh, uh, Raymond Oliver, he reported to us that he'd been in an altercation with his girlfriend at their residence on Alps Court. Um, during that altercation, uh, he claimed that he'd been stabbed by her with a knife. Um, he subsequently fled the residence to a neighbor's residence. Oliver was able to identify his assailant as 24-year-old Tracy Cloud from Bemidji. When police arrived, they got word that Cloud was parked outside of the neighbor's home in her car. As our deputy was arriving on scene, uh, pulled into the driveway behind her vehicle, um, she subsequently then fled across the yards from the driveway to escape uh, from him. Uh, he initiated a pursuit uh, from that location, uh, which uh, went from Alps Corp up to uh, Highway 89. Cloud reportedly traveled 20 miles north before the chase ended in the crash. The vehicle had uh, entered the right shoulder, uh, appears that uh, she had overcorrected. Um, at that point, lost control of the vehicle and the ve uh, vehicle overturned. Cloud was ejected from her car. Police and ambulance personnel tried to give aid to Cloud, but she was pronounced dead. It had been reported that speeds varied between 100 miles an hour and, and 125 miles an hour. Okay. Um, I don't know the, t the speed uh, at the time of the crash, uh, but uh, from my understanding, it was a, uh, a straight section of the roadway. There was no other traffic involved. Oliver was taken to the Sanford Emergency Department for treatment of his injuries. His current status is unknown. The crash itself is being investigated by the Minnesota State Patrol uh, and uh, the um, uh, assault is being investigated by the Sheriff's Office and the uh, Beltrami County Coroner's Office. Reporting in Bemidji, Sheryl Moore, Lakeland News. Cloud was not wearing a seatbelt when she was ejected from her car. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.